On the presidential campaign trail in Indiana, April 4th, 1968, Robert Kennedy was about to speak to an enthusiastic crowd when a reporter brought him the devastating news. Martin Luther King had been shot and killed in Memphis. His prepared remarks useless. Here, Kennedy breaks the news to a stunned and disbelieving audience. Some very sad news for all of you, and that is that Martin Luther King was shot and was killed tonight in Memphis. Martin Luther King dedicated his life to love and to justice between fellow human beings. He died in the cause of that effort. In this difficult day, in this difficult time for the United States, it's perhaps well to ask what kind of a nation we are and what direction we want to move in. For those of you who are black, considering the evidence evidently is that there were white people who were responsible, you can be filled with bitterness and with hatred and a desire for revenge. We can move in that direction as a country in greater polarization black people amongst blacks and white amongst whites filled with hatred toward one another. Or we can make an effort as Martin Luther King did to understand and to comprehend and replace that violence, that stain of bloodshed that is spread across our land with an effort to understand compassion and love. For those of you who are black and are tempted to fill with, be filled with hatred and distrust of the injustice of such an act against all white people, I would only say that I can also feel in my own heart the same kind of feeling. I had a member of my family killed but he was killed by a white man. But we have to make an effort in the United States. We have to make an effort to understand, to get beyond or go beyond these rather difficult times. A favorite poem, my, my favorite poet was Aeschylus. And he once wrote, even in our sleep, pain which cannot begin falls drop by drop upon the heart until in our own day despair against our will comes wisdom through the awful grace of God. What we need in the United States is not division. What we need in the United States is not hatred. What we need in the United States is not violence and lawlessness but is love and wisdom and compassion toward one another feeling of justice toward those who still suffer within our country, whether they be white or whether they be black.